Good evening everyone, it is Suki. I wasn't planning to record today, but it just so happens that while I was working on scripting, I just realized that I didn't have tank footage. I, I actually, earlier, I, I went through my hard drive that has all my footage and got rid of old footage and realized that I got rid of the tank footage I was going to use. So, yeah, I don't have tank footage, so it just so happens that I also need a cap. It's Monday, it's Monday night when I'm recording this. I wasn't actually going to cap this week, but then I figured, you know what? I need to cap. I need tank footage. Bam, that's a match made in heaven. Seventh heaven, you could even say. So, yeah, that's what we're, we're going to do tonight. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? And the, the, the good thing about this, right, is that, you know, it's, it's tanking. So, we're going to do each of the four tanks, just because, uh, and, and that works out perfectly. If we do four dungeons, that'll be just the amount we need to cap so we're gonna do expert dungeons today and uh, it should be a piece of cake you know taking uh, taking these dungeons easy the best part about this is that tanking cues are awesome for dungeons they suck for alliance raids but for dungeons it's like you know instant we're gonna start off with paladin because that's the tank that I have the most experience with I'd say Probably the tank that I spent the most time with in uh, Shadowbringer so far. Even though I do, I do actually like, um, I do like um, Gunbreaker quite a bit. The other two tanks, I'm just kind of iffy on. really need cooldowns for this, do I? I also need to remember where the hell all my buttons are, because <laughs> I do not play these often enough, really. That's the wrong button. <laughs> Goodness. There we go. <laughs> There's Holy Circle. Wow. This, this should this should get better as I as I you know get warmed up and, and actually enter things. I totally forgot that Rage of Alone isn't a thing. Rage of Alone hasn't been a thing for a long time, honestly. I don't know why. <laughs> when was the last time we used Rage of Alone? Was Rage of Alone a thing in Stormblood still? I think it was, you just never really needed to use it. Starting to recall. It's all right. It's fine. I got this. Coven is really weird. Like I, I get the point behind it, right? Because I mean, it's it's three royal authority potency attacks, and they give MP back. But it's like it's just weird doing the same weapon skill three times in a row instead of an actual combo. I don't know. It's fine. It it it, it works for what it is, but I just it, it just feels weird. I guess it it really shouldn't feel that weird though. I mean we. We do, what, like, three or, or three, five, five fell cleaves, or what is it, Inner Chaos now, on Warrior, whatever the hell it's called, uh, Frick, Soul Eater, is that what, is that what it is? Look, man, I don't remember the names of it, I, I, I understand how to play Dark Knight, but I just, I cannot remember any of the names of any of the abilities. 
At least on a on a basic level. I know how to play Dark Knight. At least I think I do. I probably really suck at it, honestly. My experience with Dark Knight at level 80 has been like... Like maybe, maybe like two level 80 fights in a dungeon. <laughs> and uh, just the leveling process in Shadowbringers. That's, that's basically my experience with Dark Knight and Shadowbringers. Despite it being kind of like the flagship jog, right? Of, of the expansion. Wow, that still hurts even with um Jolton up. Still, I still hate Divine Veil, by the way. Like, on top of needing a heal to actually trigger, it, it doesn't even affect the Paladin, which is just so lame. That's not what I meant to press. I actually really like tanking. It's just I I just don't do it enough, I guess. I don't know. It's weird cuz I, I I don't mind it, but I just never really go out of my way to do it. <laughs> like usually when I'm put in the role where it's like, "Well, would you rather heal or tank this?" I usually just end up healing it because I don't know. I feel like that's the more difficult job and I feel like more people tend to mess that up so I figure yeah well I'll do the job make sure it gets done right and then I mess up anyway and I look like an idiot oh man I wish I wish convalescence was still a thing remember when convalescence was in the game guys It still kind of is in the game. It's just um, it's it's only for warriors with um, will of battle, right? All right, this pulls stupid. I'm probably gonna hollow this because I can. I, honestly, this pull isn't even that bad. This pull is completely fine. It's just a little annoying because there's so many groups you have to pick up. I'm just going to stand at this because I, I, I'm impervious to damage. Ah, I really hate that you put this here. Because <laughs> now I can't group them up and stay in it at the same time. I appreciate. I appreciate it. We're going we're gonna to group these a little better for the DPS though. I 
I should be good to go. I, I always forget to use um my actual spells for healing damage. Also, I can just use it to heal. I never do that either. Clemency is extremely powerful, especially if your healer is struggling. Not a, not enough paladins really use it. Also, yeah, the stupid pull that happens later in this... I'm not going to do that pull. You know the pull where you pull like all the way up from this to the... Um, basically the next boss? That pull is so dumb. I'm not going to do that pull. It, it is possible, but I just... At, for a healer, it's just way too annoying to deal with. And, um, it's, it's fine if you get everything under control as the tank, but the, the problem is most tanks don't, and then it, everyone's just getting hit, and it's just, it's a nightmare as a healer. Like I don't, I don't even know why I'm like. I don't need to. I don't need to bother with positioning that much because we have two range. Screw it. Forget what I said. We're gonna we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. Uh, like I, I should have saved Hollow if I was gonna do this. Honestly. Let's see. Let's see if I can pull this off right. I mean, it's more on the healer than it is on me. But you know. The important thing is making sure that no one gets hit. Like that. That was that was not a good time to to do that as the black mage. That that's how that's how bad shit happens. <laughs> Totally manageable as long as they can kill things fast enough. Here, I'm gonna. My white mage a little bit hand. I don't think I, I. I don't think I'll try this again. I mean, it's it's going fine right now, but I, I don't know. It's just it's too messy, and I'm I'm about to die actually. <laughs> Yep. Alright, let's see if I can't save these guys. Oh, I didn't need to. We killed everything. Yeah, I'm just I'm not I'm not gonna try that. It's a pain in the ass for a healer. Like we we actually did pretty okay with having everything under control, which is usually the messy part of that fight, but oh well. I'm not gonna try it from now on. As someone who has had to heal through that, it's not fun. Any gauge. 
because I died. actually matter which way I face it, does it? Now this, I, I've done, I pulled this off successfully once where you just, you time it so that you, you perfectly do it as the hands are going out. I've done it once. I've seen other people do it, but yeah, I just, I don't know. And as the tank, I, just, I, I don't want to be in that position where I put more, more, more unnecessary work on the healer, right, by getting a foam stack up. DPS is pretty decent, I'd say, so hopefully we don't have to do another one of those stupid phases, because I, I hate doing those. The, the, the Sestasha stuff. Easy peasy. Hey, we did it. Feel it. I, I did five. What? Oh wait, that's only three. I think. Never mind. All right, we're out of here. See, easy, quick. Honestly, if we're lucky, we could get done in like an hour. Probably not, though. I'll be closer to like an hour and a half. Ooh. I am standing. Alright, oh, this is the first time we're testing out these resistance weapons. Nice. Oh wait, hold on, my, my retainers are done. Let's grab those real quick. Oh. <laughs> okay. Alright. Uh, Final Fantasy XIV, that is, that is exceptionally rare. I've played this game for way too long. Probably over thousands of hours. Uh, that's, that's, right? Probably, I definitely have over like a year in. I've never crashed. I don't think. Like, I, I, I might have like blue screen like maybe once on like PS4. But yeah, that is exceedingly rare. Hold on, let's let's make sure that this is all okay and everything. There we go. I guess uh, they really didn't want me to. Um... Oh crap! I'm gonna be still locked in, aren't I? Because I crashed. No, oh, all right. 
I, they, they really didn't want me to check my retainers. That's fine. Yeah, okay, we're back. It's, 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 nothing happened. Man, I remember when I used to spend all day crafting. Then they, then they made it so that script turnings didn't give gill, and now I I don't craft that much anymore. Good times. <laughs> Honestly, the, the the sheer amount of crafting I did in like the first few months of this expansion is probably what kind of drove me not to post as much because. Usually I'd be like, oh yeah, man, I'm, I'm I'm just gonna spend the day doing doing dungeons and stuff, recording, getting these scripts done. But no, I was like, oh, I I want to craft. Like, to, it's uh, you know, cunning craftsman syrup is start today. I want to get that money. Whoa, wait, what? No, so only when I'm on my tanking, you know, spree. That that's when you want to put DPS's adventure in need. I see how it is. All right, well, let's see. What do we want to do next? So many choices. Uh, let's, do, let's do Dark Knight. Yeah, I'm, that's 7,000. That's 7,000 gil, that's gonna kill me. That's gonna set me back real, real hard. Hey, we got this one this time. I don't like this one as much, but we got this one this time. All oh, right, I remember why I don't like Dark Knight that much in in this expansion. It's because it's because they they made I mean it's always been a thing but it's just it's always been, it's been a bigger problem nowadays because we have delirium now because of how delirium works but um I I hate the fact that your AOE are considered spells so you don't actually get you know well not delirium but um blood weapon blood weapon that's 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 the one I'm talking about I forgot that Dark Arts need to be triggered with MP now. I... I do like that, you know, Dark Arts, you just, you know, one button, you got it, right? <laughs> Whereas... Whereas freaking, they still make warriors go through a whole combo to get up Storm's Eye, which is just, I hate it. And Storm's Eye only lasts 30 seconds, which is also just annoying. I don't actually know if, um, I don't play Dark Knight enough to know if it's actually better to do single target or AoE on two targets. I'm just gonna assume that you do single target.
I don't know if this is a magic. It says Shadow Bolt, right? That sounds magical. That's another thing too that I wish they'd really do. It's like make it easier to tell if if something is a magic or physical attack. Like it doesn't even have to be like. Why keep it a secret? Oh, crap. Alright, I wasn't expecting that to push me. That dark Knight feels so weird. It's probably just because I haven't really spent that much time with it. I do actually, I do like it better than Warrior. It just, it feels, it, it plays extremely similarly to Warrior. I already possessed one of those items, man. I'm also not paying attention to my blood gauge at all. Like, <laughs> also, I, I, ju I just realized your your shadow clone, Shadow Freight, it, it has the same uh, destination as your pets. Has the same like hex as your pets. I mean, I hit no one with that. Alright, I have high hopes that we can skip the second ad moving thing.
I hope we're not all gonna stand here. Yeah, I don't. I don't think. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna we're gonna beat this in time, actually. We definitely aren't burning it 25% before this happens. Oh well, you win some, you lose some. Stuff we can roll on. Look at all this stuff. I can't roll on that. Target's out of range. My ass. My, my controller crapping out, it's fine. I've been using this controller forever. I'm honestly kind of surprised it hasn't crapped out earlier. How some of these guys are casters? Man, that, that Astrologian is very, you know, optimistic that we're going to get this in time. I feel very optimistic about my ability to stay alive. I don't even know if this will go off, but you know, I'll cast it. What the hell? The answer is no, it won't. <laughs> no, it won't go off. the gate black is night just just a couple more seconds to break it's a big shield like black is night for defense is fantastic it's a big ass shield
I don't know if that will break. No, it, it, it didn't. <laughs> let me let me stand in this cone real quick. Let me <laughs> let me let me break my blackest night real quick. All right, two down, two to go. That was this is going by, you know, it's all right. I, I'm spending a lot more time concentrating than I thought it would be. Let's go warrior next. Have some fun on warrior. Uh, yeah. Flash. Let's see, this gives me HP healing, right? Yeah, restores 50% HP. Uh, no, I just absorb 100%. It's the person who I give it to that gives 50% H, 50% uh, of what I do. I wonder if that's actually better. Probably is better than just doing raw intuition. But I mean, six seconds for 20%. It's not bad. Uh, the, the thing about Flash though is you actually do have to target someone else, which is kind of annoying. Or he has some good cooldowns, man. Oh, we're back to this one. Neat. Definitely not gonna do this stupid pull this this time. I just no thanks. That once was enough. I I died. It wasn't really <laughs> wasn't really the the most fun experience. Hey look, we even get a bonus this time. That's neat. Yeah, definitely not doing uh, that pull. Why am I doing my single target rotation right now? This is not what I should be doing. It feels weird. I, I'm used to like seeing Steel Cyclone and all that stuff on my bar. It's not there anymore.
Oh, well, yeah, that's one way of doing it. You know, I still think Felcleaves is is much more cool. That's that's <laughs> it's it's much more cool than um inner inner chaos. I don't know. I'm just, I'm glad you still get to do a bunch of Felcleaves still, since uh, inner chaos you only do when you're infuriated. I can't wait to reapply that. And I wish at the very least they'd increase Storm's Eyes duration to like 40 seconds or something. Fantastic use of that inner inner really I don't even care. Like <laughs> who cares? It's a dungeon. I don't know what I'm doing. I haven't played Warrior in like six months. That's not even an exaggeration. I still say that Heavensward Warrior is my favorite. Kind of miss the old Wrath stacks. Also, maybe I should make a macro for Nas and Flash. Nas, is it Nas sent? Nas can't? I don't know, man. Honestly, it's way too difficult to to like. It's not difficult, but it, it takes too much effort, I guess, is, is the proper way of saying it. It's not difficult to do at all, it's just, it takes too much effort to select someone to to use it for. I mean, it's like, imagine Dragon Sight, but doing it four times as often. It just sucks. So I just, I just press the, the raw intuition button and, and we're good to go. What the hell happened to our white mage?
Whoa, we're, we're really cutting it close with these heals, man. Holy crap. Vengeance. Vengeance is like so good. I'm gonna use Vengeance. <laughs> it's the same thing as every other one, it's just that it reflects damage too on Warrior, which is just, it makes it cooler. <laughs> I didn't actually think about that. Does does Mask and Flash stack with um with uh shit thrill of battle? Just makes your heals even better. Cause I mean thrill of battle's abilities, I'm pretty sure. As well as not just or healing actions it says, not healing spells. Oh man, this 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 pool. I'm scared about this pool. I'm not sure about this pool. But I mean, you know, whatever. Nothing a little, you know, home gang and band addiction can't solve, am I right? first time I actually like I've always noticed that there's tethers here I this is the first time I realized that there's just there's just Sahagin just on the edges of the arena when you walk in that's the first time I, I've done this dungeon so many times I am an idiot Oh right, I think the summoner's new. Eh, oh well. Best way to learn is experience. I, honestly, every time, uh, like I, I've, I've always used the uh, the trust the first time through, just because I like seeing the NPC interactions. Anything, anything to make me do stuff without actual real people, I'm all for. Just, just sign me up for that.
We're gonna do this in two pulls. I find it kind of annoying that, you know, it's it's a cone into a, a circle attack. I don't know, that just bothers me. Alright, we're stopping here, alright? Because, like, I don't know, I just, I don't... I, I, I don't want to put the healers through that. It's, it's also, I mean, it's not that much faster. I died last time I did it. Also, this summoner's, you know, new, so it's like, it's a good chance that, <laughs> you know, things just, just, things just don't die as fast, because, you know, they're still gearing up, and also summoner is, historically, a lot of summoners just don't do very well. I'm not saying that this summoner is, isn't doing well, but I mean, just like, historically, like, it's, it's probably the job that most people mess up the most. And uh, I honestly, I can't blame them. Like, a lot of the stuff of, about playing Summoner properly is not very intuitive. Like, I remember I poured over that, like, Auk Morning Guide for like, like two, two to three hours before I even understood the basic grasp of what I was doing. And even then, still, I, I totally don't remember any of it. <laughs> Like, I spent so long learning how to play it, but I just, I totally do not know anything. I don't remember anything about it. I think I spent like a good like hour and a half sitting in front of the training dummy as well. Uh, is the healer not here? Like, what is happening? There, there we go. Honestly, for a second, I wasn't paying attention that much. I kept trying to move the mobs over to where Bahamut was because I thought it was a, I thought it was an enemy. I don't know. I was just, uh, my mind is just not here right now. I'm honestly surprised I've only died once. I mean, I guess to be fair, like when a tank dies, it's 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 usually more on the healer unless the tank just not using their cooldowns right which unfortunately is a lot of tanks, unfortunately. I like, I like being redundant, don't I? I think I said unfortunate like three times in that sentence. I have to watch that back. I won't, but I, I should watch that back and see. God, this thing will never get old. We're we're already almost like a year into Shadowbringers. It's crazy to think about. Like, holy crap. That takes forever to go off when you're waiting for it. Come on, he's right there. Come on, come on. No. Oh. Intuition. Into it. Alright, it's fine.
I, did I forget to use Onslaught? I did, didn't I? It's alright. It's fine. I think we already established that. I'm not very good at Warrior. guy's gonna... Will he live? Oh, he did. He moved out of it in time. Honestly, I was more concerned about him actually living than getting this other ad, but it's fine. I believe. Let's kill this before the next thing has happens. <laughs> there we go. Alright. One more to go. Easy. Easy peasy. I don't know what I'm doing sometimes, but, you know, easy. Just realizes this, this weapon's called the Skull Render. It's like the most warrior thing you could you could call this. Uh, what? What? Gunbreaker. That's right. Oh, that's not instant. I am somewhat disappointed. Uh, are we going to get? Uh, Shit, what's that other one called again? Grand Cosmos. I almost called it Royal Menagerie. That is like, that's that's way old. That's not. It's it's kind of. I was thinking, you know, because like it's all like. It's a palace or whatever, so you know, Royal. I don't know. It was a long time ago. Royal Menagerie. That that was forever ago. It's like three years ago. Man, when when you think about it like that, like you think retroactively or retrospectively. Uh, like, like, how long it's been since expansions have happened? Like, I've been on YouTube a long time, with this channel in particular. Because I started in, like, I think 2.3-ish. I mean, those videos are ancient. Like, don't don't go back and watch those. They're still on the channel, because I just, I don't, I don't really believe in deleting videos. But, yeah, man. That was, like, PS3 era with like an HD PVR. Was I using an HD PVR back? No, I, I think I was using just a normal Elgato back then. I don't remember. I'm sure if I, hey look we did. Nice even split, but I'm pretty sure if I, I, I go back. If it was in 720p, it was with uh, with an HD PVR. The Elgato uh, would have been in 1080p. It wouldn't have been in 60fps, obviously, because, I mean... Honestly, actually, PS3 doesn't go up to 1080p, does it? It go only goes up to 720. So, yeah. <laughs> that's, that's just a blatant lie. Also, I really like Gunbreaker. I'm kind of iffy on Warrior and Dark Knight, but uh, Gunbreaker's a lot of fun.
Like, I know a lot of people like to say, oh yeah, man, if you want to you want to tank but still feel like a DPS play Warrior, honestly, I feel that way more about Gunbreaker. Gunbreaker feels much more like a DPS than Warrior does now, in my opinion. You, you probably, I mean, you don't you don't get those, like, insane, like, direct crits like you do with uh, with Warrior, but it just, it, uh, it, it, feel, it feels like it flows more naturally, Gunbreaker, which is why I like it more. We're good. We're good. I just, I just wanted to get this combo in. <laughs> let's, 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 let's not even kid ourselves. It's the whole reason why I just ran in there. We have double ranged again. Neat. I don't worry about positionals. <laughs> and turn the boss all I want. I remember this one time. I was actually playing this with one of my real life friends who, um. It's funny, like, I have a lot of friends who I play games with, but none of them, none of them want to play this game with me. It's a sad, sad, sad world we live in. But, uh, I remember we, we were doing Hawk Manor. And he was leveling up his gladiator, and he was just, you know, messing around sort of thing, just kept spinning the boss. And it was, there was a poor little monk who just could not get his position because he kept doing it. Uh, good times. Fond memories. Also, I still, I still don't forgive Square Enix for um, messing with the sound effects for Gunbreaker. <sighs> I just... That happened so long ago that most people probably forgot, but like... The original sound effects, you can still, you can go back to the job action video and you can still hear the, like, the original sound effects. Um, yeah, it's so much better. Like, now it just sounds like you're swinging a club around, which just isn't as satisfying. I don't know. I don't know why they changed it in the first place. I don't know what monster was complaining about the sound design for Gunbreaker, but, um, yeah. I wouldn't say it ruined the job for me, but I certainly would be enjoying it a hell of a lot more if it had those old sound effects. How fast we're burning through these mobs. Feels good. Uh, well, you know.
I just wasted that. Oh, that's fine. faith that this this party can handle the uh the no second seedling um requirement dps <laughs> I, I don't know why that came out so weird Maybe not. Which way are we blowing? This way. Look at all these good rolls I'm rolling. When I actually want to roll high, I never do. But it's like, oh yeah, all this all this gear fodder that you just trade in for grand company seals anyway? Nah, here you go. Here's, here's your 99s. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have rent so far ahead. <laughs> As the tank, I probably shouldn't do that. Should probably pace myself a little better. I've had a lot of people complain about camouflage. I love camouflage, man. Like I like it better than Dark Mind. Even though Dark Mind, Dark Mind is pretty strong against spe specifically against magic attacks. But I mean, I mean, on top of the parry chance, you do get the, just the flat 10%, which is nice. Don't have any of those. <laughs> like, hey, what, what's going on? Why can't I use my my faded circle? Oh, maybe because I don't have any cartridges. You idiot.
I don't know how that got so out of sync. Oh, I know how. Never mind. I also just love all the animations on, on Gunbreaker. It just, it, it feels cool. Got that stump, uh, yeah, that stump. It's about, I was gonna, I was trying to say steampunk, but I decided instead to just combine the word steam and punk to stunk. It's got that stunk feel to it, you know? Love it. I'm just so good with words. It's weird, because... The thing is, like, when it comes to public speaking, like, when I had to do it for, like, classes and stuff, like, I hated doing it, but I was actually okay with it, which is probably why I'm okay with all these hundreds of hours I've spent talking to myself in a room, but, man, I, I just, I trip over my words so much. I mix up my words all the time when I'm doing this. I don't understand why. Oh no, you're gonna burn. Okay, wow. You actually managed not to burn them. That's an impressive. This is a very awkward positioning. Oh, well, there goes that piano you saved earlier. Well, it doesn't really matter. We have plenty of... <laughs> plenty of furniture left to burn. When it comes to this, like, it's actually not that big of a deal if you actually take the hit from close quarters. But, I mean, I, I, I usually follow everyone else's lead. As a healer, I don't actually care that much. That reminds me, this game's free. Well, by the time you're watching this, it probably isn't free anymore. But it was free on PSN for like, a, like, like a week maybe, maybe half a week. But hopefully, if you haven't picked this up yet, and you were interested in it, you did. Probably should have made a video earlier about it. <laughs> but there we go. Look, like just an hour and twenty minutes. About you know, twenty minutes per per run. I'd say that's about it. About right 20 minutes average per per one anyways i have my footage now so that's taken care of i'm all capped now so that's taken care of that's a win-win in my book and we did it and we didn't even spend like a whole lot of time on it so thank you everyone for watching 
Uh, now I have footage for this, so that'll be good for that video that'll eventually come out. Hopefully sometime soon, whenever I get off my lazy ass and finish it. So hopefully you enjoyed. I'm actually, I'll probably tank more often. I actually had a lot of fun on Gunbreaker especially, so I think I'm going to get some more Gunbreaker in, um, in, in, the, in the coming weeks and all that. So yeah, a lot of fun. I'll see you guys next time. Sayonara. Bye-bye.